Welcome back to Darkwood. We've just woken up on day three. And the traitor has apparently visited us, so let's see who they are. Oh, they're interesting looking. Can't tell if that's like letters and stuff scribbled all over their arms and their clothing or just something else. A man, roughly my size, is standing before me. I can barely make out his disturbingly familiar features through the matte visor of his helmet. The massive helmet is covered with an old sack and seems to be an integral part of the unnaturally pale body. Yeah, it seems like it's melted into them. Ah, oh, it's so cool, you can see their breath in the mask, fogging it up. I remember him. He's the one who rescued me from the doctor's house. Oh, I remember, yeah, after, like, shortly after, between escaping the doctor's house and waking up here, I remember, like, a couple images, a couple flashes of somebody extending their hand to, I guess, help me, and I think they were wearing mittens, which looks like it's this person, given that they have mittens. The man reaches out to me with his black hand. It's covered in charcoal. There's something written on his worn woolen glove. We need to stick together, brother. His lips are moving, but all sounds are drowned inside the helmet. He shrugs, then takes the huge sack off of his back and drops it on the ground, revealing its contents. Uh, I can't ask them for gossip. <laughs> I guess they're not very talkative. Show them the photo of a road. He wipes his left glove on his pants takes out the charcoal from his pocket and starts scribbling. When he finishes, he lifts his dirty hand. All roads lead deeper into the woods. Okay. Oh, it looks like they buy seemingly pretty much anything. And they also sell a hell of a lot. Um, you know what? Before you even look at what they sell, let me go grab some of the stuff that I stored in here. So what kind of stuff might be worth selling? Maybe pills. Uh, definitely the medium caliber bullet. I mean, it's completely useless to me without a gun, and it's probably going to be a while until I get a gun. What can the battery be used for? Probably to, like, refill a flashlight, maybe? I'm not sure. I'll put that on my inventory, though. What did that say? Well, this time it said nothing. But before it said they, like, take a step towards me and pat me on the shoulder. So yeah, they definitely seem very friendly. Gas tank? Hitting the valve will release a high-pressure gas and result in an explosion. Hmm. So it sounds kind of like a terrible grenade. A grenade that you have to trigger with probably a gun or something. Flare. It's weird. So there's pill, and then there's pill. There's different types of pills. But they're both called pill. This one heals, this one says nothing. <laughs> they also have a red egg. Tape. Shotgun shell. A magazine. A gun magazine, that is. Tubular magazine. A barrel, frame, bolt handle. Yeah, those aren't happening anytime soon. Shovel blade. What could I use a shovel for if I was able to make it? I mean, is there any sort of digging that I need to do? I might be able to make one with, like, a metal pipe and a shovel blade. I probably need, like, some tape or something, too. I don't know. I probably need to upgrade my workbench as well. Oh, right, I want the watch. God, it's so expensive, though. Hmm. Odd-looking glowing mushroom. Oh. 
It's worth 50. I could buy that. I should probably buy gas, though, shouldn't I? Nah, let's live life dangerously. <sighs> what else should I buy? I don't have to buy anything. I could just raise my reputation. Whatever that does, it sounds like a good thing. Let's go with that. He nods. Okay, can't craft anything. Should I keep... I was going to say keep some matches, but do I not have any matches at all? Looks like I don't. Damn. Alright, well I guess I'll leave the rag behind. I was thinking if I had matches I could take it and maybe make a torch. So I'll just take bandages, a lockpick, my two boards, and I'm about to process the mushroom. Because I'm about to head outside and explore. Ooh. That's enough for... something. Um, let's see. Staying in dark areas at night can be dangerous to me. Well, that's not an ability, right? Uh, I will be able to see farther. Once a day, I will be able to heal myself by standing next to an electric light source. Once a day, I'll be able to learn my current location on the map. Eh. Be able to heal myself by eating mushrooms. I think either once a day heal or see farther. Let's do see farther. Oh. I have to choose a negative perk. Staying in dark areas at night can be dangerous to me. I mean, sure, it already is. Okay, next dose takes a lot more. Alright, goodbye, friend. See you some other time, hopefully soon. So I wonder what that see further actually means in practice. Does it mean I can, like, move my view further? Like when I do this? I don't know. Well, whatever it is, it can only be a good thing. So, while well, time is... Still frozen. Let's decide where I want to go. Some skills. Oh, I didn't read my journal, did I? Hmm. Nothing new for day three. Well, now I have a weapon, so I can actually get into some combat, I suppose. Maybe let's check out this little camp. Right over here, I think. Alright, time freeze is over. It's time to be on our toes. Ooh. Oh, that's a, quite a bit of gasoline. dogs. We must be near it. Broken tractor. Wait, where am I? Oh, it's just to the right of the camp. Okay. Battery. Worth nothing. God, I'm going to feel really bad if I have to kill these dogs, but I'm pretty sure they're going to attack me. Locked. Ah. Finally a use for a lockpick. Wait, what? What did I just do? 
Did I just use it? I thought I had to put it in my... No? What? What is it doing? Oh, I'm... <laughs> this is the crafting menu. I just made more lockpicks. Oh, this is my actual items. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. I sounded near. Oh, there it is. Okay, I'm safe. Scrap, battery, matchstick, more gasoline. Oh, I've got so much gas. And some of these are, like, full. Okay. Alright, let's see if this dog attacks me. Mm, it's gonna attack me, isn't it? Oh, he's just barking. Oh, oh, oh. I hate it. Meat. Can be used as a bait for carnivores. I got hurt a little bit, but I'm okay. Okay, so I can maybe use that to distract the others and loot the camp while they're away. Where is the camp exactly? right here. Oh, these are not like... These are bushes. They're not like weird masses. Okay. Yeah, that's too many dogs to take on. Okay. I'm not sure how far this is gonna go. It's working. Yes. Oh no! One stayed behind. Oh crap. Oh, 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 I think it I think we're okay. Oh thank god, we're okay. We're okay, we're okay, we're okay. Close, search, grab everything really quickly. Yeah, we're good, we're good. Gas. Uh oh. Okay, that didn't last long. Okay, we got some stuff. We got some stuff and now I'm pretty much full, so I should go back and dump this stuff. Yeah, you fill up your inventory so fast. Maybe I should have taken the moth one. Restore my health. Nah, that's fine. bandages. I've got two bandages. That's... Oh, and those are with alcohol, so that's probably perfectly fine. I don't think I need to craft more. Can make a chain trap. Battery scrap. Yeah, I'm gonna toss everything but the lockpicks and the bandages. Okay. Let's go back out. Where to now? So we've done Broken Tractor and Camp. Maybe I should go to the underground- No, I still have no light source for the underground entrance. Could check out the shrine. Maybe I'll just go right this time. See if there's anything just... Just straight to the right. Looks like lots of lumber. Ooh. Oh, I can make tons of planks out of this. Throwable stones might be used as a distraction. Oh, this is really good stuff. I'm gonna have to go right back and dump this stuff, though. Yeah, it's 
gonna give me so many planks. Is this marked on the map? Nope. Alright, let's go dump it. So I guess I'll just turn them all into blanks, huh? Alright, need more fuel. God, the thing makes horrible noises. Shh. Is that it making noises? It sounds like it's crying. I don't like it. I feel like I was gonna grab something else, was I? Uh, I don't know. I'm gonna keep the stones on me as distraction things. through all the fuel. Yeah, look at all these boards. Just one log left. I'll just leave it in there. Can I build this now? Yeah, just four. I've got 27. I can drink from it. Oh, that heals me. Can I drink infinitely from it? Well, I don't dare waste it. Okay, well, with all those boards... I can make a torch now. Takes a rag, a little bit of fuel. Match. Okay, let's make it. Okay. Oh, let's put that out. Just don't want to waste it. Alright, let's go back out exploring. Although... Uh, before I explore too much, again, just to make sure that I have a, a safe place to come home to, let me refill the generator. I'm not sure what it's at, but just be careful. Oh, is it totally out? Oh, it's totally out. I wonder if you need to turn it off when you wake up, or does it turn it off automatically when it becomes day? Hmm. Okay. So let's go back over there where the wood was and maybe keep going right. Where's my torch? What the hell? Did I accidentally put it in a thing, or... I don't... Th I, I thought it didn't burn up on its own. You had to have it equipped. Maybe it does burn up on its own. No, I just accidentally put it in there. Okay. Now we're good. So I'm guessing this is super thick. Oh fuck! Jesus! I guess that's what happens when you touch the super thick forest. I was gonna say I'm guessing it's impassable. It's not only impassable, but it hurts you over time. The well is dry at the moment. Check back tomorrow. Okay, so it's a one-time heal. Shit. Well, learn my lesson.
Where am I exactly? Look at that tangle. Trees. Am I near the underground entrance? Oh. Would it attack me? If it would attack me, it could gore me to death very easily with those antlers. I'm assuming it would just run away. Okay, it wants to come after me. Okay. Oh. Well, the wildlife is definitely affected. I mean, the dogs want to kill me, even the... What was that, a moose? Elk? Something? Even that wants to kill me. It certainly normally wouldn't try to just kill people. It would run away. So I think I'm on this path. Down to the burned houses. I guess I'll just continue on down that way to the burned houses. Oh, fuck. What was that? Mushroom remains. I'm pretty seriously hurt. I don't know if I just entered darkness or by walking into mushrooms I hurt myself or what. Oh, this is... I'm down here, near the broken tree. I'm over here, I guess. Oh, oh, that's what I'm hearing. Oh, God. Just like the one by the, the shrine, they're running away from me. What's that? Whoa, 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 something's really wrong with this place. Christ. I just picked up a shiny stone. It's worth 130. Nice. Yeah, something is very wrong with this place. attacks them. They interact with each other. You're not coming towards me, are you? Oh, 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 oh. Still coming after me? No, oh, okay, we're good. Brook. So I'm down here. I want to see if there's, like, something down there. Let me see if I can distract it with a stone. I uh, might not need to. I think we're okay. Yeah, we're okay. Hope this doesn't hurt me because I'm so close to the darkness. This doesn't go anywhere, though. Yeah, there's nothing down there. Alright, let's make our way over to the burned... Actually, yeah, let's go through the shrine to the burned houses. Well, that did not go far. <laughs> I don't think it hurt it at all. I could probably go pick it up if I wanted to. Wait a minute, my view's getting all yellow. That means it's close to nighttime, isn't it? Shit. Hmm. I guess I need to head home, right? Damn. I wanted to hit the burned houses, but it's okay. I guess I did do quite a bit of exploring, didn't I? Let's go back. Uh-oh. Follow the tracks. I'm gonna not heal, because I've only got the strong healing things. Which would probably be a waste, since I'm not even below half. And... I have the well that I can drink from tomorrow.
Alright, so we're good on power. I'm not going to turn the generator on just yet. Actually, I probably should, shouldn't I? Yeah, okay. stone keep the rest I could make a normal bandage perhaps let's do that just to be careful here we go let's make another chain trap how many can I make one more two chain traps not bad Another one down here. Maybe I should barricade. What does it take? Boards and nails. I got plenty of boards, that's for sure. I'm not sure how I'm doing on nails. Oh, 48? I got tons. I'm kind of scared to get too close to, because of the chain trap. the monsters can slowly break it down. I imagine I'm not just like perfectly safe just because I barricaded these. Put a chain trap down. Okay, that's every single window barricaded. Mind you, that does not help with this spot over here that has the wardrobe in front of it, because that's just a gaping hole. And now... What? Uh oh. I'm gonna go in there in just a sec. I'm gonna just put these things in here. You're not real. No. I need to get away from here. Can't click on them or anything. Dare I try to hit them? Whoa! Alright. Seems to have worked. I didn't leave the front door open, did I? Oh my god, I did. Fuck me. Should probably barricade that, huh? 
But then again, how am I going to get out of my house? I don't know, they just knocked on the door before. Oh, 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 oh. Where did you come from? How did you get in here? Pushed it slightly. Oh. oh, oh. Okay. This wardrobe does not do a very good job. Maybe, Maybe if I just stay here, it won't be able to move. <laughs> I'd rather just be back here, and just keep an eye on it. back. Good. Alright, I think I'll end this episode here. I hope you've enjoyed so far, and when I return, we're going to continue with day four.